Welcome to another fragrance moment with two from Byredo. Uh, I'm not even going to try to pronounce the name Cellier and something of the night, Reem de Nuit. All right, guys, I'm going to tell you these two right here from Byredo. Uh, most people would never smell them or never buy them because the $335 for 50 ml. This one's classified as a dark, jammy kind of rose. This stuff is potent and it smells incredible. I just don't like the price point. Yes, it's extract the parfum concentration, but this one, guys, uh, this is one I'm going to wear a lot in the cool weather. I love a nice, solid rose offering, but especially when a rose leans more jammy-like. This is a, if you like the rose, the jamminess of the rose in Cafe Rose from Tom Ford, but it, you didn't like the, calf, the, the coffee or the sweetness, you will probably dig this, man. Um, and it's hard to kind of classify this rose because so many roses tend to be a little brighter, a little bit redder, more of like photorealistic. This is dark, deep, sultry. This stuff is like brooding. It's a kick-ass bad boy of a fragrance. And I'm going to tell you, every time I wear this, <laughs> yeah, especially when you put it right like back around here and just kind of walk, women go bananas over this stuff straight up bananas but then you go to its brother Cillier and this one right here this is a straight up masculine sexy monster sexy masterpiece of a fragrance Clint Eastwood uh, Clint Eastwood, Chuck Norris and Burt Reynolds all in one bottle and this stuff lasts for, both of these things last for like 8 to 12 hours plus uh, and just a little bit will do you. So uh, if you like, if you want to smell like something that not a lot of people smell like, these two will fit the bill. Now I know Byredo is known for, of course, Baldur Freak. Um, some people like Gypsy Water or Mojave Ghost. Pulp is another good one. Um, you know, Byredo does fragrances really, really well, but they tend to be. Uh, in my opinion, on the lighter side. So you're getting anywhere from like four, six, maybe eight hours from the fragrances. These, not that problem. I mean, you can just look at the, the juice color and the darkness and the depth of these juices and understand uh, this is something. Now, the funny thing is my local Neiman Marcus carries these, but in order to get this, you usually have to either get it maybe from Byredo if they carry it. If not, you got to go all the way over to Selfridges in London to get this stuff. So I'm glad I have both of these. A great quick fragrance moment. If you're in Atlanta and you get by Neiman Marcus, put your nose on these. Put your nose on them and swim. Put one over here and put one over here and just watch what happens. You will smell like this stuff all day. You'll be getting little wafts, little tastes. But these are great fragrances. Till the next time, your godfather is out.